Joe Vegan's being such a jerk. This is a word. This is a world premiere. This is a word. Hey y'all, so first of all, I only put Joe Vegan's name in here because I knew that that's all people want to click, is people only want the drama. And there's so many other things going on in the world right now that people should be paying attention to. I want everybody who watches this video to make a point to go and watch the interview with Noam Chomsky on Democracy Now!, please talking about some of the more crucial issues that people might want to give some focus to if they're really interested in having, you know, a less poisonous world, you know. If you have some concern for, say, things like climate change. If you don't want to see the U.S. go to war with Russia, which I'm sorry, y'all, there is not a country out there that would get out of that one unscathed. I'm not gonna repeat the whole thing now, but I am going to encourage any of you who really have any interest in really anything, really any interest in anything, to go and watch some Noam Chomsky today. It was his interview on Democracy Now! So what is today? Today's Tuesday, the, what are we now? The Saturday was the first, Sunday second, Monday third, so fourth, yeah, it's the fourth. Just check it out, do yourself a favor, go learn something about the world, go educate yourself. Don't be one of those people who's walking around here talking and saying stuff like, you know, I'm not gonna name no names, but their name rhymes with name. Joe Vegan's live stream popped up on, you know, my You Now notification, and I saw it and I ignored it. I was not interested. I didn't really want to get, I didn't want to get sucked into the drama. Then I saw that Vegan Revolution was having a live stream. Vegan Revolution keeps it real. I don't agree with every word that comes out of his mouth. I don't know if we get along that well, but I think there's some mutual respect. And he certainly watches my videos from time to time, and I watch his videos from time to time. All that to say, he was talking about Joe Vegan and the fact that Joe Vegan had blocked him and wasn't answering his questions while he was trying to sit in on the live stream. And I know Vegan Revolution can be, you know, really can be a hard ass. Um, it was also cool to see Martin Lewis and Mad Blender. Yes, Mad Blender in Vegan Revolution's live stream. He's great. He reads what people are posting, reads the questions, responds to the questions, really knows how to engage with his audience. His live stream ended and I was immediately taken to Joe Vegan's live stream, which was not what I wanted, but you know, while I was there, I figured, you know, I would see what he was going on about. And he's there trashing vegans. I don't know, I just don't understand it. I don't understand why you can't just move on. Move on, you're not vegan, okay, move on. But clearly it's drawn a lot of attention to him right now and he seems to be really interested in capitalizing on the attention that it's getting. I'm sure there's money to be made and like he says, he's got a baby to feed or whatever, but it's just. So I posed a couple of questions in the chat box and one of the questions I asked him was, I understand that you're not interested in veganism. You know, what are you gonna be about these days? Ignored the question. I asked a couple of times in a few different ways, what are you moving on to? What are you gonna be about? What is it about you that somebody like me can stand behind and feel like is worthwhile to even watch your channel? And the dude was like, I don't understand what you're talking about. If you're going to make a comment in the chat box, please make sure you use correct spelling. Really? When he read the question, he paused. I could see that it was like, doo -doo 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 -doo. he was trying to compute that mess and it didn't compute. And that to me says everything. When you can't answer the question, what are you about? That tells me you ain't about nothing. You ain't about nothing. This is a person who made their career trashing vegans. Now they've moved on from being vegan and now they just want to trash veganism. But not gonna be about anything. God bless, do your best, moving on, don't let the doorknob hit you with a good lord split you. I just can't be about that. So I'm not even gonna ask y'all to comment on this. If you're moving on from being vegan, there are ways to move on without tearing down the whole house. Veganism did good by Joe. Veganism did good by Joe. And really all he has to do is trash it. And it's not about whether or not he's vegan. Y'all know, y'all watched my video yesterday. My husband's not vegan. A lot of people I love are not vegan. But just because you're not vegan doesn't mean you have to trash veganism. You could just 
live and let live, let go and let God. The fact that that is the thing that I had to make a video about as opposed to making a video about what's really, really important in this world. The fact that all of the best things about our society are being stripped away. Greedy folks dividing up the resources and saying screw us to the rest of us. That the nuclear clock is like two minutes to midnight. But we're talking about Joe Vegan, shaking my head. That's it for this video. Like it if you like it, share. <laughs> Comment, subscribe. This is Reg signing off. Love yourselves. Peace. And I love myself.